ambazo tunatengeneza county aggregation industrial park hii mambo ya blue economy hapa tuweze kukusanya ile mapato yetu yote na rasilimali yetu yote ya kilimo ya uvuvi tuweke katika barabara ya agro processing value addition tupeleke mpaka manufacturing ndio tuhakikishe ya kwamba Kenya inasonga mbele na vijana wanapata ajira sio kama tunaelewana jameni tuko pamoja kwa hivyo mambo ya maandamano tuachane naye mambo ya kuchoma barabara tuachane naye mambo ya kuharibu biashara ya watu mambo ya kuharibu mali ya umma mambo ya kusambaratisha eh, kazi ya wananchi wengine hiyo mambo tuachane naye mimi nasikia watu wengine bado wanatuongelesha ati mambo ya maandamano who told you the only solution is maandamano kwani wewe una akili ya kufikiria kitu kingine kwani hii kabondo hii nini tumejenga hapa imejengwa na maandamano mlifanya maandamano tukajenga hii landing site hapa lakini siko complete so please tusiweke mambo ya maandamano mbele mpaka tukaharibu nchi yetu kwa sababu wale waegezaji wanatutazama wale marafiki wetu development partners wanatutazama kama kazi yetu ni fujo kama kazi yetu ni kuharibu mali ya umma na ndio nilikuwa namwambia wanjala kwanza unipatie hakikisho ya kwamba tukijenga hiyo barabara hamtachoma kwa sababu kama barabara ni ya kujengwa ndio ichomwe siheri tuwaje tu kujenga eh, bro <laughs> wanjala amekubali amesema itachomwa <laughs> Yo, oh, na maana maana haitafanyika hapo ya kuchoma anybody. Si namna hiyo jameni. Please. Mimi nataka tukubaliane, tuendelee pamoja, tusilete fujo, tutengeneze taifa letu la Kenya, tupange jameni ajira ya hawa vijana. These young people are looking for us, are looking at us as the leadership of Kenya on how they are going we are going to expand opportunities for them so that they too can make a meaningful contribution to growing our economy and growing our country. And that is a debt we owe to the young people of our country. Tutashirikiana watu wa dunia hii jameni. Na ndio pia nimesema nataka munisikize vizuri nikimalizia. Nimesema hivi. Kuna rasilimali nyingi. Kuna products nyingi ambazo bado tunaagiza kutoka nje ya taifa letu na ili hali tunaweza kuzipata hapa Kenya. Sio kama tunaelewana. Na ndio nimesema kwa hii budget ya kwamba we are going to levy taxes on those products that we can produce locally but there are people who notoriously want to continue importing. Imagine katika hii budget mimi nimesema mambo ya steel ambayo tunaweza kutengeneza hapa Kenya hatuwezi kuagiza tena kutoka nje. Mambo ya simiti ambayo tunaweza kutengeneza hapa Kenya tuko na raw materials ya kutosha hatutaagiza tena kutoka nje maneno ya furniture ambaye vijana wetu tumewaweka kwa Tivet vijana karibu nusu milioni kila kila mwaka wanatoka Tivet watatengeneza hizo furniture hatutaagiza furniture ya kutoka China ama Ulaya ama mahali mengine si, samaki just imagine ati samaki tunatoa ya kutoka China sio ni upuzi mingi sana ati kwa sababu samaki yetu ati imepungua hapa chini kama imepungua tufanye restocking kama iko shida ya usalama tu sort out mambo ya usalama. Kama shida ni infrastructure kama hii tuweke infrastructure ya cold room and cold room facilities. Ndio eh, eh, ndio vijana wetu wa, watusaidie kuvua samaki. Kama ni shida kina mama hawana pesa ya kufanya hivyo, huyu mama Victoria ameleta pesa, tupatie kina mama waendeshe hiyo maneno. Ama namna gani? The solution is not going is not to go and import things that we can produce here in Kenya is not to go and improdu, uh, import fish which we have here in Kenya. Alafu kuna mtu anaenda kupinga hiyo finance bill. Ati hapana tusifanye hiyo yote tuendelee tu kuleta samaki kutoka nje, tuendelee kuleta furniture kutoka nje, tuendelee. Sio ni wazimu. Ama ama ni nini jameni? Nyi mimi nataka niulize nyinyi, mnataka tuendelee kuleta samaki kutoka China? Tuende kuleta kitanda kutoka China? Kwani kitanda inahitaji hesabu gani mingi science gani kutengeneza? Kitanda si ni mbao? Na randa? Na msumeno? Na nyundo pamoja na msumari? Si mambo imeisha? Ndio nimeambia hao wadosi kama hamut, kama mtakosa usingizi kwa sababu kitanda yenu lazima itoke China heri mkose usingizi. Na kama uwezi kulala kitanda imetengeneza na hawa vijana lala chini. 
There is no problem. Ama na magani jameni. Tunaelewana? So, nafikiri tutashirikiana hivyo. Eh, ile maneno eh, mjumbe wenu amenieleza bile bile ya nini? Mimi nataka nishukuru governor. I must be grateful to Governor Otuoma. Hii title wakati nilikuja pale niliambiwa shida ni title. 